name is Risk Lepto. I work for Schneider Electric, a technical uh, trainer for protection relays. Schneider Electric is the leading provider of arc protection solutions in the world. And now we are introducing a new interesting device called V125, which is a signal unit which you can uh, uh, install feeder by feeder. It has uh, deep switch settings so you can do uh, uh, configuration without using any software tool. You have the connection power supply full range. You have the trip outputs, you have the fast uh, semiconductor output and you have the um, mechanical trip output. And you have various other outputs and all the mounting we have two solutions. You can use DIN rail inside switch gear or you can flash mount it by using an additional color around the device. So let me power on the device. Initially you will see green power LED indicating that uh, the power supply is connected. At the moment I have not connected any sensor, so this device supports up to four um, point sensors. So now I will connect two of the sensors to this device. I have them already connected to the terminal block and I just add them. In this case uh, device will go to maintenance mode. The reason is that we change the configuration and that means that we have to do a reconfiguration of the device. That is done in a very easy manner. It is combined with the reset push button here, but I need to press it for around 10 seconds and the relay will reconfigure itself. So I press this now. Now the maintenance LED disappeared and uh, the device is ready to be used. This functionality is used also for cell supervision. So in case there will be a problem with the sensor or we remove a sensor, we will immediately get a cell supervision alarm. I will demonstrate that. I remove it again. And we can see that we have a uh, blinking LED indicating which sensor is now disconnected and also the maintenance LED will be on. I reconnect it and it will automatically uh, notify that now I fix the problem. Now uh, we can use the point sensor and make a flash of the simulating an arc flash. I will use a strong flashlight I have, which is a camera flash, so this is the uh, most uh, uh, recommended way to simulate and flash during the commissioning. Uh, we don't recommend to use like handphone or something like that with this LED light, which do not have high energy on the light. So now I will I will uh, have this on the sensor part and I flash. Immediately we'll see that we got an activation. Uh, we have both of the sensors of the light because they are so close to each other. We will see indication that both triplets will uh, uh, activate. And we also have some additional signals where we could connect and other uh, similar device and transfer the light further on. This functionality can be then uh, changed by the deep switch settings. I recommend to get detail of this deep switch settings, you will download the manual from the Schneider homepage, uh, schneider-electric.com uh, for detailed information. Now when the, the relay is in, in, in activated mode, I can reset the relay by pressing shortly this push button. So this push button has two functionality, installation with the long pushing and short reset of the relay. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, for further information about Schneider Electric products, please visit our webpage schneider-electric.com.